Hey guys, so recently I was trying to find out what the best VPN is on Windows. I tried out a lot of different options and I narrowed it down to what I think are the top three VPNs you can get on PC. There's ExpressVPN, ProtonVPN, and NordVPN. All three of these have excellent Windows apps that you can just download easily. They all have a hundred plus countries, fast speeds, and they just work well when it comes to getting you access to content and giving you a more secure connection. As usual, there will be more information and links for all of these in the description below. But starting off with my number one pick, ExpressVPN, this is going to be the best VPN if you want something simple, easy to use, but at the same time powerful, where there's a lot going on behind the scenes that they don't bother you with. You just have in front of you a very easy to use VPN. All you need to do here is click on the location button and a window will pop open with all of the 105 countries you can connect to. So for example, let's say you're outside the United States and you wanted to get access to the US Amazon Prime Video Content Library. All you'd have to do is just type in here USA and you'll see the list of servers you can connect to. ExpressVPN has the most US connections of any VPN out there. They have at least one in every state and in some of the big states like New York and California, they have more than one server connection. So if you need a VPN to connect to the United States, then Express has the most options by far. I'll just go ahead and connect to Chicago and I'll X this window, click connect. And in just a second or two, we're gonna be connected up to the server right here. Once you're connected, it doesn't really matter where in the world you are. You can go to amazon.com and access the Amazon Prime Video Content Library that's available in the US, which happens to be their biggest content library. Every streaming platform will offer different content and sometimes they'll offer more or less depending on the country you're in. When it comes to Prime Video in particular, they'll offer the most in the US. So a VPN connecting up to the US will get you access to the most movies and TV shows that are available on Prime. Now, I should also mention that all all of these VPNs are also very secure. Besides for getting you access to content, they also give you more security. They're gonna encrypt your connection so that no government, internet service provider, hacker, even the VPNs themselves cannot access any of your internet activity. And in order to back up that claim, what VPN companies do, or at least the more legitimate ones will do, because there are a lot of shady and somewhat sketchy VPN companies out there, what the better ones will do is an independent security audit. They'll get an outside company to come in and check out their systems and report on it and really ensure that they are keeping up to their standards and they don't have any security risks or vulnerabilities. In that area, ExpressVPN has done the most. They have just done a ton of different security audits of all different parts of their company, all of their products. Proton VPN has done four pretty much every year from 2022 through till 2025. And NordVPN has done five audits as of now. So overall, if you ask me what's the best, both in terms of security and just ease of use, getting you access, not bogging you down, just kind of plug and play, set it and forget it. That would be ExpressVPN. This is the one that I use on a daily basis and the one that I always find myself coming back to. Now, in second place would be Proton VPN. Can. And that's because there is a lot more going on to Proton. There's a lot more features. It's definitely not as beginner friendly as Express, but it is very powerful and it has a lot of different features. You're going to get things like Secure Core, which connect you up to very secure VPN servers in case you're worried about the VPN server being uh, breached or compromised. You have P2P servers, which are optimized for torrenting and file sharing. You have Tor servers that will connect you up to the Tor network for more privacy. And you also have some added features over here like port forwarding which is very good for file sharing if we go to the advanced settings you can change your nat type this is great if you use a vpn when you're gaming all of these vpns by the way come with a kill switch split tunneling and some form of ad malware and tracker blocking all three of them have those three different features in particular so that really isn't so special when it comes to proton vpn but you do get some other nice features you also do get a few more countries than ExpressVPN. Express has 105 and Proton has 127. So if you're looking for more features, maybe you're a more advanced user, uh, if you like the map interface, that's also very nice, then you might find that Proton VPN is going to be the best for you. Now, lastly, there's NordVPN, and where Nord really stands out over Express and Proton is going to be one in terms of their countries. They have the most 165 globally. So even though they may not have the most in each country, like Express has the most in the United States, around the world, NordVPN 
VPN by far has the most, 165. That's just a crazy amount of countries. And they also have a lot of nice add-ons um, independent of the VPN. You see with ExpressVPN and Proton, you need to have the VPN connected in order for features like their anti-malware and tracker and ad blocker to be activated. But with NordVPN, these are independent add-ons. They have a very nice add-on called Threat Protection Pro, which also gives you anti-malware, browsing protection, and an add-in tracker blocker. And this is independent to the VPN. You don't need to have the VPN connected in order for this to be working. It functions totally independently. They also have an option for secure file transfers and something called MeshNet, which allows you to connect different devices more securely for things like remote desktop. They have dark web monitor that keeps track of the internet and the dark web to see if any of your personal information has leaked out. And in some plans, they also have secure cloud storage. So they have a lot of different features in general, but where they stand out is these add-ons that are independent to the VPN. So if you're looking for not just a VPN, but a whole group of different tools that you can use to get more security and privacy on the internet, the NordVPN is a great pick. And while all of them have an application for Windows, they also have apps for Android, iOS, Mac, even browser extensions. So you're pretty much covered for all of your devices. If you wanna find out more about any one of them in particular, I've done full reviews for each of them. You'll find links in the description. There will also be discount links there so you can get the best possible price and save yourself some money. If you have any questions, feel free to leave those in the comments below. I'm always looking to hear what you guys have to say. That's going to be it for this one, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Have an amazing day, and I'll see you in the next video.